Commentator Karen Malone fired back at accusations that Brexiteers and the Brexit vote had concentrated on scaremongering. The pledge contributor hit back at claims from Rachel Johnson, the Remain backing sister of the Foreign Secretary, that Brexit had stoked fears in the country. Malone defended Michael Gove's speech this week, where he spoke out in reaction to criticism of the government over the Windrush scandal. Mr. Gove declared that Britain was the most immigration-friendly country in Europe since the vote to quit the EU. This prompted backfire from across the country, including Rachel Johnson, who said the Vote Leave campaign headed by Mr. Gove stoked fear of immigration. She said, it wasn't what he said, but it was the fact that Michael Gove who said it. Gove fronted the Vote Leave campaign, which didn't have a dog whistle in its anti-immigrant sentiment, it was a loud clarion call. There were posters threatening the arrival of 76 million Turks into your village. They terrified me and I'm part Turkish. Getty Malone fired back at accusations that Brexiteers and the Brexit vote had focused on scaremongering I think that's rich coming from the Remainer. Carol Maloney stoked fear of immigration throughout the campaign, and to now say oh come in, the water is lovely, we are warm and not hostile is frankly very rich. However, Malone tore into these remarks from her pro-U colleague on Sky News The Pledge. She said, one of the things you said, that the Leave campaign stoked fears. I think that's rich coming from the Remainer. The Remain campaign was the one that stoked fear. Sky Govey declared that Britain was the most immigration-friendly country in Europe since the Brexit vote. Ash went on to cite Crown Prosecution Service figures that proved there had been a dramatic fall in hate crime prosecution since the Brexit vote. In her response to Malone's comments, Johnson admitted that fear of immigration had fallen to its lowest levels in recent years. During his address, Mr. Gove pointed to a survey by Ipsos Mori last year which showed 40% of British voters felt immigration had a positive impact. This figure was compared with 18% in Germany, 14% in France and 10% in Italy.